Hi family, welcome back to our devotion time. Today is June 5th and our devotion is titled The Response of Praise from Psalm 89.1 I will sing of the mercies of the Lord forever. With my mouth will I make known your faithfulness to all generations. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we give you praise and honor and glory, Lord, that you so richly deserve today. Father God, we ask that you would be with us during this devotion, that you would teach us, Lord, that you would help us to have a deeper understanding that our life is an act of praise unto you. And that, Father God, the words that come from our mouth, Lord, should lift up and not tear down. I praise you and I thank you for your mercy and your goodness. I ask for your anointing upon my speech today in Jesus' name. Amen. Just 20 years after the pilgrims arrived in North America, they printed a hymn book, the Bay Psalm Book. The fact that the first book the pilgrims published was a hymn book reveals just how important praise was to these early North American Christians. The singing of psalms or songs from the biblical book of Psalms was standard in many denominations for centuries and still is in some churches, and it is not hard to see why. The biblical the biblical psalms made up the hymn book of ancient Israel as they praised the God of Israel in worship, and the most consistent theme of psalms of praise was the faithfulness of God, his covenant love for his chosen people. God's words and deeds toward Israel can be summarized in one word, faithfulness, and it was the faithfulness of God that the psalmists wrote about and the choirs sang about. With my mouth will I make known your faithfulness to all generations. Praise is the proper response to God's faithfulness. Take a moment to think of the ways God has been faithful to you and offer him your praise. If you ever wonder how to praise the Lord, just lift up your voice. Raise your hands. The Bible says that our hands are hands, the, raise holy hands unto the Lord. Lift up your voice. Make a joyful noise. It, just because you can't sing doesn't mean you can't praise. Amen. And praise is, it should be a way of life for the child of God. We've spoken about this so many times before that I'm not going to dwell too much on it today because I know that you guys have a deep understanding of this, but lift up songs, turn music on in your house, walk around the house and pray and talk to God and worship Him. Read Psalms out loud. That's a wonderful way to praise God and thank Him for the day. Thank Him for what He's done in your life. Everybody has a praise. Everybody has worship in their hearts. The book, the Bible tells us in Romans 12, 1 that we are called to an act of spiritual worship. Amen. Let's read that. It says in 1 or 12, 1, I apologize. And we've read it so many times before, but it's always good to read it again and again. Paul says in 12, verse 1, I appeal to you, therefore, brothers, by the mercies of God, to present your bodies as a living sacrifice, holy and acceptable to God, which is your spiritual worship. Amen. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. God is so very, very good to us. And He loves us so much. He is so faithful. So take time today to offer up your praise unto Him. And spend time in your Father's presence, basking Him with your love. Amen. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we love you. We thank you so much for today's devotion. We thank you so much, Father, that you've given us a voice to praise you, that you've given us the words to praise you, that you've given us the psalms that we can read unto you and that you rejoice with us over your faithfulness. You rejoice as we walk in faith with you and we love you, Father God. We know that you love us so very much. We give you praise and honor and glory in all these things we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Go bless the Lord. I love you guys. Have a blessed day. Be safe. Be, be good. And um, don't forget to hit the like button and help me share the videos. Become a member of our family by subscribing to the channel. And I love each and every one of you. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.